And now we're going to explain about the uh, rook polynomial for an n by n board with all the squares being white. So here we're going to do n equals 5. Okay. So uh, suppose we want to uh, work out the coefficient, say, of x cubed. So x, uh, coefficient of x cubed, that's the way, number of ways of placing uh, uh, three non-challenging rooks on this 5 by 5 board. Uh, so they have to, uh, the three rooks, they have to go in three different columns. So let's choose which columns we're going to put them in, uh, say columns 2, 3, and 5. And then we're going to choose which rows we're going to put them in. So maybe col uh, rows 2, 4, and 5. Okay. So now here, uh, the, uh, the blue squares we've got here, uh, those are in uh, columns 2, 3, and 5, as indicated here, and rows 2, 4, and 5, as indicated here. Okay. So now what we've got is basically a 3 by 3 board with these blue squares. And we have to place three three non-challenging rooks in it. And so that's uh, kind of what we did in the previous demonstration. If you've got a k by k board and you want to place k rooks in it, there's k factorial ways. You see we have to place a rook in every row. So there's uh, three choices for the first row. And then uh, we've got two choices left for what goes in the second row. And one choice in the third row. So there's three times two times one is three factorial ways to place three rooks on this three by three blue board. So... Uh, <clears throat> Uh, so how many choices do we have for that? Well, we had uh, five choose three ways to choose the uh, column set here, and five choose three ways to choose the row set here, and then uh, three factorial ways to actually place the rooks once we've decided which rows and columns they're going in. Uh, more generally, yeah, so you've got, uh, <coughs> yeah, if we've got, um, if we want to look at the coefficient of x to the k, um, that's, uh, we have to uh, place k rooks, and so we have to choose k, uh, k k columns for them to go in. There's going to be n choose k ways to do that. Then we have to choose k rows for them to go in. There's n choose k ways to do that. And then that gives us effectively a k by k board, and there's k factorial ways to place the rooks on it. So that gives us n choose k squared times k factorial as the coefficient of x to the k. Uh, let's just do one more. So uh, yeah, if we want to place two rooks, say, then uh, yeah, we could decide to put them in uh, in columns two and five and then maybe in uh, uh, rows one and four okay so that's uh, once we've chosen the uh, chosen the columns and chosen the rows that leaves us with a, a two by two board and there's a two factorial which is two ways to place two rooks on a two by two board okay so that was uh, five choose two ways to choose the columns five choose two ways to choose the rows then two factorial so that's 5 choose 2 squared times 2 factorial as the coefficient of x squared.